Welcome to Everyday Juggling, the place where you can find some of the best videos of juggling and object manipulation posted on the web from week to week. My name's Sean and what you need to know about me is that I love juggling, and I want anybody watching this video to just for a bit enjoy juggling as much as I have all these years. I've got all kinds of great content lined up for you today, but before we look at that, let's look at some news. Personally, I've been getting my website filled out. You can check it out at everydayjuggler.com. I've got a blog there where you can keep up with recent juggling news and original content about juggling. Also, you may have noticed that there's links in the video description to all the props featured in each of my videos. If you go to those links and buy the prop through those links, then I'll get a small commission and you'll help support the channel. TheAdvocate.com published an article about the Baton Rouge Fire Guild, and it's all about a flow arts community that practices in Baton Rouge. The article does a really great job at profiling some of the people in the club and sheds a really positive light. It's great to see that no matter where you are, there's an object manipulation community available to join. Also, Uber Gizmo featured an article about Japanese students building a robot that can juggle a kendama toy. Kendama is a traditional Japanese toy that has been adopted by the object manipulation community. I searched the web for some videos of this robot juggling, and I couldn't really find any good ones of this particular robot juggling, but I found one of another robot juggling the Kendama. So, check it out here. Hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. As I said, we've got a lot of videos to go over today. We're going to start with a video from Dubai of a dude hat juggling. The reason I like that video so much is because I love touristy things. I love it when one culture tries to appeal to another culture. Obviously, he's a great hat juggler, and I'm really excited that I was able to feature a hat juggler on the channel. The next video is pen spinning. I showed you some pen spinning last week, but I can't get enough of it, so here's another video. I love pen spinning for two reasons. First, it kind of blows my mind how fast the person spinning the pen is spinning the pen. I don't understand how they do it. But also because the videos are usually pretty short, and I like that. The next video is from a dude named Kenny Chung. This is a compilation video of all the different things he can do showcasing what he can do. I really like when he juggles clubs. I think he juggles clubs very gracefully. So, check out a clip here. She's Make sure you check out the rest of Kenny Chiang's video by clicking the link in the video description. This next video isn't a professionally done video, but it shows an amazing feat. The record for how long someone can juggle seven balls was broken this past week, and this is the video to prove it. So check it out here. I can only imagine how tired his arms must have been after juggling seven balls for almost 13 minutes. Super impressive, congratulations. This next video is from Kuma Films. I showcased one of their videos last week, and I'm gonna show another one because they do a really great job at making awesome videos. This video features a dude using a fire staff and doing it in really beautiful places. Check it out here. The fire flow arts kind of freak me out a little bit. I'm kind of afraid to be moving something around real quick, lots of fire on it, but maybe you can talk me into it. Maybe I'll give it a try one day. All right, now I'm gonna show you a bunch of videos from the Japanese Juggling Festival. 
The Japanese Juggling Festival happened last week, and there were a lot of great jugglers doing a lot of amazing things. We're going to look at poi, club juggling, regular juggling, contact juggling, cigar box juggling. So a lot of stuff, really quick. Here we go. As you can see, there's a lot of great jugglers in Japan and they can juggle almost anything. In particular, I loved that poi video and that juggling club video. I thought they were very creative and original. I saved this next video for last this week because it's absolutely amazing. I love videos that are well done and I love things that are unique, creative. This video is a combination of cigar box juggling and contact juggling. And it's really cool. Check it out here. Van Loop Performance did an amazing job at putting that video together, and that juggler is amazing at balancing props. That's all I have for you today. If you liked what you saw, make sure you like the video, share, comment, and subscribe. Also, if you saw any prompts that you want to purchase, make sure you use the links in the video description so that I can get a little commission and you can support this channel. See you next week! If you like what you saw, be sure to subscribe. And if you're interested in joining me live in my free webinar to learn to juggle, make sure you visit my site at everydayjuggler.com.